Santa, you know. Mm. Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. So, for today's video I thought we could do stocking fillers because I love Christmas and I love doing Christmas content, finding really good deals, really good gifts for you all and for myself. So, if this sounds like a bit of you, please keep on watching. But before you do, hit the red subscribe button down below and let's get into it. You need to bear with with the background because it's a bit random really, isn't it? But this is just the best we could do for now. The table's messy. I don't even know if that's like a rug or something. But I've got a list on my phone, so I'll read them out and then put like a little screen recording at either side. So the first thing, um, a lot of these were on Urban Outfitters, which I think are really good for stocking fillers. And the first thing was like a pack of three Real Techniques sponges. So I think you get um, the like orange sponge and then it says the cleansing sponge, which I've never seen before and a prep one and it's like a gradients complexion kit so that sounds nice i'd be very happy to get this i feel like it's it's just a good investment everyone needs sponges it's something you forget to buy yourself as well like for my birthday i've asked for two <laughs> because and at christmas um last year owen got me this tree and it had like um i don't know how many it had in it like eight and it was so useful for this year because every time one took monkey i had the other one to pick up but yeah, that is £16, which I don't think is too bad. Um, and I think that would be a really nice gift to get a friend as well if you don't want to spend too much. Next, number two, is a Tangle Teaser. So you can get different ones of these. But my favourite is the one that actually has a handle. I feel like it's just easier rather than like the, the dome ones. But I mean, you can get mini ones as well, which are really good. So... This is £12 and this is just the purple one. I have a purple one and a pink one. They are so good. No brushes compare. If you don't know what to ask for and you want to ask for like a little small gift or you don't know what to put in a stocking, these are so good and it's better to have more than one hairbrush. This is more of a, like a need than a want, but they're good. They're better for your hair. They don't damage it. If your hair gets not in, my, my hair is literally growing at the speed of light at the minute like i cut it myself all the time um but i just don't like to put heat on it and these brushes help a lot as well especially when your hair's wet i feel like i need to really detangle it sometimes but yeah i think that is definitely a good gift idea next keeping on with urban outfitters i had a really fun time on this website um these are like ice globe cooling facial tools so i'm guessing you put them in the fridge or the freezer and they're like little balls with like a stick on the end where you just make it like go on your face and it de-puffs like really helps your under eyes these just look so satisfying like i need these for christmas like i if i'd known about these for my birthday they'd be on my birthday wish list like right now because they just look so good and like you know when you just woke up and just feeling a bit puffy like you didn't have a good night's sleep these they're 20 pounds which i mean it's not the cheapest is it they could have done at least 15 but um they probably i don't know they have no reviews yet so but hopefully they are really good they are called mallows beauty i've never heard of that brand before but they looked really really good Next, this I think is really cool. Is someone really drying their hair right now? So, next is a Boo Berries mask. So, it's literally like a face mask for your boobs, your nipples, and it's got like blueberries on. Who doesn't want that or need that? I want that. <laughs> I feel like that is really good because you don't think about to do that there. But now I want one in every single one. Like, I feel like they had a few different ones. I actually need them all because I feel like they just didn't need it. They have, I'm pretty sure they have another one as well that's called like the Juicy Pear. Um, um, they're like sheet masks. So they're £9 or I think you can get a couple in a set. They're vegans, which is good. I just like the name, Boo Berries. <laughs> but I think this is a really good little gift idea, especially if you're getting it for like, um, I don't know, you know, if you're doing like a little box of like little pamper goodies, like a little pamper box for someone, I feel like it would be really nice because a lot of people would definitely never think of this. I mean, I would never think of this. Next, I think this is a really good gift because I love disposable cameras. So 
I like to take them away with me and I'm thinking for my birthday this year to get a few and like take them on a night out because I feel like the pictures are so much better when you don't know what they're going to become and then you can get excited to like look through them. I went camping with some friends last year and got them printed but I like to do a lot of scrapbooking and if you know someone like is interested in photography I think disposable cameras are a really good way to go. They're quite retro and old-fashioned I mean it's the same with like Polaroid cameras I mean if someone has one of them definitely buy them some film for that rather than a camera it'd just be easier but um I don't know it's just quite fun that you don't know what they're going to turn out like and then obviously after the day's gone you've got um the cameras too and you can all look at um your memories so I think this is a really good idea it's 14 pounds on Urban Outfitters but I think you can get some off Amazon or like local shops like photography shops if you have any near you I have one near me and I'm pretty sure you get a camera for £10 and they do the film within that price. Next is for men. Well, whoever wears boxers, it doesn't have to be just for men. But I always get Calvin Klein boxes for Owen or just some nice boxes like that. I feel like they always want them at Christmas. So you get free a free pack for £38. Um, I mean, they've got five-star reviews, but you can get them off ASOS or anywhere like that. I just saw them while I was on the website scrolling through the gifts. Um, well, I feel like they're just a staple, aren't they? Like getting men boxes. It just is not much to say, but I feel like Calvin Klein are really nice. Or Ralph Lauren, Levi's, um, Armani, anything like that. Um, but I think Calvin Klein are just the ones I normally go for. But yeah. Next is something we all get as well, and that is socks. You know, I like to get socks. I feel like a lot of people don't. But I really like to get, um, like, Adidas socks or Nike socks. I think they look cool, like, at my Crocs. <laughs> but, like, you know, like, when you can see them when you're wearing a dress. Um, but also fuzzy socks. Primark do really good ones. I mean, Urban Outfitters will definitely have fuzzy socks. But anywhere with fuzzy socks in winter, it's a must it's a need but yeah it's a bit boring socks i understand that but everyone really appreciates them okay next this is a bit random it's 12 pounds and it's a remote control light bulb but i think these are quite cool especially for like a teenage boy or something like that or if you have like a spare room maybe that you want to have a different light in but like if they're doing gaming and stuff it might just be cool um it's a bit random but it's different and it's something they can actually use and make use out of rather than just clothes all the time. And I feel like it's nice to put random things like a stocking or as a small present. I think I'd really like one of these um, for my room, to be honest. Um, depending, obviously, what colours you get. But I feel like it's just quite cool. Like, you can match them all up if you have more than one. I think I have three lights in my room. But it is quite a long room. <laughs> But I really like the concept of this and I wonder if you can get like a plain light colour as well or are they all just colourful but it comes with a remote but yeah it's just pretty simple but I feel like if someone was gaming or into that um, or have like strip lights around their room they could match this to it as well and for £12 it's not too expensive at all really. Next I thought I'd add in some food because a lot of people like to get food or what is it like chocolate coins at Christmas in their stocking but these look really nice I mean obviously you can just go to B&M and get whatever you want but these are caramel chocolate penguin tiddly pot and they're like they're like buttons from Hotel Chocolat and they are two pounds each which aren't too bad but if you're ordering for my mum always gets stuff off here for like Owen's family like and my sister's boyfriend's family so it's just like if you want to do that and you've got you see like little things like this you can just add them in the basket as well to put in people's stockings but I think it just looks dead cute and rather than just getting some chocolate from being if you just want to be a little bit extra you can get these two pounds not too bad next is for the baking the bakers the star bakers this is 750 on not on the high street and you can get like a little picture and someone's name on a wooden spoon how cute is that i feel like especially in a stocking if you get something like this which is tailored to someone that really likes baking or anything like that they'd love it they'd probably they probably wouldn't want to use it and just keep it but it's not too expensive it's really cute and um you can get like little baking sets as well but obviously if you just put it in a stocking and it's good to have different textures in a stocking they're all like bulky <laughs> but yeah um 
I think they're quite cute. Someone's called Zach Ryan Trish. And I don't know um, if you send a picture in uh, to get like the picture on it or they just sort of design something, but I do really like it and it's nice. I feel like personalized gifts always go quite far at Christmas. Next is a Xbox glass. I think they had PlayStation ones as well. This is on Next and it's £10, but it's just nice to get someone. I feel like mugs or glasses and stuff like that, they're just good to bulk up a stocking. They're not too expensive, but like this, if you know someone likes Xbox, this could be like the drink they have on the side while they're playing or like a cute mug that has like a Christmas quote on or something like that. Stuff like that, they're just cute, especially if you need to just get someone a little gift, like a friend or a secret Santa or a cousin, you know, they play Xbox or someone you play Xbox with. I feel like it's nice. It's not too bad for £10. Next, I always do really good Christmas gifts as well. I never think of them, but I went on last year and found so many good ones as well, like for stocking fillers, like a glass is a bit random. But I feel like small gifts and stocking fillers are quite similar. And this is quite a good small gift, especially for someone who likes gaming. Um, but yeah, I'm quite happy with that one for £10. I don't think it's too bad. I'm sorry if you can hear the dishwasher in the background. <laughs> Let's ignore that. But next, I feel like we should talk about Lush and Lush bath bombs. Because not even just the bath bombs, though. I feel like... The Snow Fairy is so popular. And honestly, because it's been so long, I actually can't remember what it smells like. <laughs> like, but they do like um, body spray, shower depth, shower gel, body conditioner. Um, they have a bath bomb and they do like little sets as well where you can get like a bath bomb and a mini, like, what do you call it? shower gel for only £12 it comes in a box it to bulk out stocking or I think that would make a really good small present if you were getting that for like a friend a secret Santa or especially if you don't know someone that well and you I mean this is snow fairy they've got to like it <laughs> and if not they can give it to someone else <laughs> but I think that Lush is a really really good place to go other than that um next have a trio of christmas bath bombs which look really cute so i mean i think that is quite a good idea to be fair i think there was like i can't remember i can't remember i forgot to save the link but you will see it here there was definitely like a little snowman maybe a gingerbread man and something like that but if you don't want to go on lush or you're just getting stuff up next anyway it's easier to do that and they're just cute, aren't they? And I think they were under £10 for three of them, which isn't bad, to be honest. Next is ASOS. So I thought this was really good as a small gift, or you could actually open it up and put all the stuff into a stocking. It's only £25, and I'm pretty sure it's called The Gift of ASOS Skincare, and you get a Elemis Superfood... What is that? Cleansing Foam... Egyptian magic cream. Um, I can see a pixie glow tonic there. They have quite a few different things. And for £25, all their minis. And I feel like a lot of them might actually be quite expensive products. So you can test them out. Or whoever you're buying it for can test them out before you get them. Which is a really good idea. And I mean, I'd actually be so happy to get this gift. I feel like this is really good for a friend. I know if I was doing a secret something this year I'd definitely get something like this for my friends because they love skincare so much as well like me and how many do you get one two three four five six seven eight I don't think I counted that right but yeah there is eight products and they're all skincare related so I feel like someone would really like this gift next let's talk about candles so I really like these off ASOS it says psychic sisters and they have a few different candles. They have a love candle, which is rose and lavender scented. I think they have another lavender one and a sandalwood and black pepper, which is the power one. They're all different colours. And I feel like they have different meanings, which would be really nice. And you don't want to put like a big Yankee candle. I mean, you can if you want. But as a good small gift, these are only 6 99 on ASOS. So if you've got next day, that's good. 
um and these i'm pretty sure they're not too big of a candle so it'd be really good especially if you're doing gifts under 10 pounds as well everyone likes a candle um I will definitely check though and see if they have any Christmassy candles. But then again, because it's on Christmas Day that people get this, I feel like the, you don't need a Christmas candle because it's after Christmas. You want something fresh for the new year. Does that, does that make sense? The same with candles. These are the Revolution Reed Diffusers. So this one that i'm showing is called call me angel which i think is really cute it's got like the black and pink vibe but they have a few on asos 12 pounds oh they got 20 percent off today but yeah i feel like a room diffuser looks really nice especially on the side and if they have a few different colors i think they have a white and black black and gold purple and black so you can get one to match someone's room or just see what scents they have to be honest see which one smells the nicest i know my mum loves room diffusers and stuff like that i have one from primark in my room at the minute but it actually doesn't smell of anything which is really weird like i can't smell anything out of it it's a bit depressing so maybe i should ask for one of these for christmas hopefully because i've got like a little cute table i feel like they just look cute sat on the top next is phone cases so I get my phone cases from Coconut Lane and you can use the code Lorraine30 for money off but they have so many. I On my phone that I'm filming on right now, that is the 13 Pro Max and I have a tough, these are the tough phone cases. I think they're about £25 but the regular ones are 15 so just depends on what you want but I feel like change up your phone case to match your outfit, match the mood, you know, new year, new phone case. <laughs> I think it's a really good gift to get someone as well and they do bulk up the what do you call it stocking which i think is a good idea and um, i'll probably do another stocking video before christmas because it literally is like the 10th of november today but i just get really excited about christmas and i'm already thinking about what to get people so i think a phone case is just a good one to end it on to be honest I feel like a lot of people don't like buying, I, I don't like buying a phone case, you know. I have one and I just leave it till it gets a bit tatty. Like, honestly, I've had this phone case for so long. I don't know if you were to see, there's so many scratches on the back of this one. Um, it's just annoying. It's annoying to have to get another one. But they just, they're a vibe. I feel like I want to get loads of different ones and have like a drawer of them and match my outfits to them. Is that sad? I don't know. But thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please like and subscribe. Let me know what other videos you want to see. I'll probably do a video for like men's gifts, women's gifts, gifts for him, gifts for her. <laughs> and I might do another one of these if I see some more ideas. But I do have some from last year. So I'll link them down below and please go check them out. I hope I didn't say the same things. I tried to make them a bit different because you can just watch both for loads of ideas. But yeah. Thank you and I'll see you soon. Bye.